So I'm in London right now and I've been meeting with clients and what's very interesting is there keeps being this theme that comes up when I'm talking with my London clients. And I've heard it now for the last few days. I had to shoot a video about it. We have Westminster Abbey behind me. It's a beautiful country. But here's the thing I keep hearing. You don't understand people in the UK. You don't understand about the economy, the vocabulary. And what's interesting is I get that. It is a different place. It is a different country. But here's the interesting thing. Yesterday in our live session, after hearing that excuse for about the 15th time, I said, so you're telling me no one in the UK is an entrepreneur. No one in the UK uh, makes money online. No one in the UK speaks or writes or coaches. And the person said, yes, it's very difficult. So then I went and showed them a video from the UK about hundreds and hundreds of people that are crushing it in the UK, that are making successful business leaps. And the person just got a smile on their face. And I said, listen, no judgment, but if you go out and wake up every single day and say, no one in the UK is buying, guess what? No one in the UK is buying. It's your RAS filter, your reticular activating system. Your mind's eye will find exactly what you tell it to look for. And so this person smiled, this person was coachable, and this person said, you know what, that is true. It is a self-limiting belief. Now, are there people in the UK that are not buyers? Absolutely. But we are growing fast in the UK and we are making tremendous advances because we believe we can. And I'm not saying it's just about belief, but I'm saying that you, you will find exactly what you're looking for every single time. If you look for people that uh, you say, you know, everyone always rejects me, everyone always thinks I'm foolish, I, you know, I always make mistakes. Guess what? Your brain is gonna be programmed to do exactly that. So here's the advice today. Literally ask yourself what you're looking for. Literally sit down and write that out. What do you want in your life? And then begin rehearsing it over and over again. And the crazy thing is, as you align your desire, right? As you align your thoughts, your actions are going to follow. It's like if I look over here, guess where I'm starting to walk? I'm starting to walk over there because that's my focus. Your focus is everything. And sure, we're all gonna get bumps and bruises and it's not the law of attraction and blah, blah, blah. I know all of that. But all I'm saying is that this young lady yesterday woke up today actually with a completely new set of mindset. Uh, she is completely aware of the possibilities in front of her and trust me, she will find some clients because she is telling her mind to look for clients wherever she goes. This is Carrie Oberbrunner. Be a soul on fire. Stop letting others, other people's unbelief and other people's popular thinking, stop letting that catch up with you because it's not, it's not the results you want. So discard it, throw it away, trash it, and begin feeding your mind with new thoughts. Begin fortifying your faith. Live from London, this is Carrie Overrunner, Be a Soul on Fire. We'll see you very soon.